Hey folks, uh, checked my mail today and there was this uh, large duct taped uh, lump in there with a whole bunch of very fancy looking, very official uh, Royal Post Office labels on it. And this seems to be a package from uh, Rick Kershaw Moore, who I sent some Brinks padlocks along to, and hopefully he's actually gotten them by now. That was a while ago. So let's see what he has sent in return. Get all this uncocooned. Come on. Almost there, I think. There we go. <laughs> okay, we've got a tin here. It's got a good weight to it. it says a really useful place for keys that don't fit anything in the house anymore. <laughs> and let's see what we've got inside. Okay. We have... Hmm, what is this thing? Oh! A retractable hook pick with a built-in turning tool. Now that's very cool. We've got... Okay, it's some variety of cam lock. It even says cam lock on it. Eastbourne. An Eastbourne cam lock. Uh, given the tailpiece, this looks like the sort of thing you might put on a, um, a desk drawer or a cabinet to uh, keep it closed. Sometimes uh, these linkages with the extra hole in it uh, might be used for those uh, large uh, supply cabinets that have the uh, locking bar that slides up and down, but uh, that should prove uh, to offer some fun. And then we've got the next layer, oh, got a Euro cylinder here in a bag with some keys, let's see, Smith and Lock, can't say I'm familiar with them, oh, Smith and Lock. Looks like a uh, copy of a Yale Euro cylinder, double-ended. Oh, and it's got the, I um, forget what the this rating is, but it's I think, called a diamond rating or something. Uh, and the number of stars is supposed to be how well it is supposed to stand up to uh, various types of forced entry. So that should be fun, too. But, uh... We'll try all of these things out in some future videos, but in the meantime, uh, thank you very much to Rick uh, and all of you folks over in, uh, in the UK, and um, hopefully we'll uh, get these open on camera pretty soon. So, uh, until next time, have fun and happy picking, everyone.